What's going on? Sergio the Pro here. I got something new for y'all. Good friends at Nyko sent us over the Raven. It's a PS3 controller, but it's shaped like a 360 if you can see the designs. Now for Nyko, I can see why they did this. You know, there's a lot of PS3 gamers out there. There's a lot of 360 gamers who want to be on the PS3, but gotten so custom to the 360 controller, it's often them to be switching back and forth. So Nyko was like, hey, I'm going to do one controller for the PS3, which is like 360, so you know, they don't have to switch going back and forth. Like the controller, it has great, it has a great feel. Me being a 360 gamer, it feels right at home. Don't have to have any adjustments or no learning curve or anything. The only thing that I realized is that it's real loose. Like the sensitivity is crazy. Like when I was playing Madden, I kept jumping the line, getting uh, encroachments, offsides. Uh, when I was playing Call of Duty, I was just spraying everywhere. I couldn't, I couldn't hit anybody really and I had to actually go to the PS3 controller it was native to it even when I threw on some uh, control freaks to you know try to give me more motion it still still was just spraying it wasn't accurate uh, but when I played 2k it felt right at home I didn't it was just like I was on the 360 kicking ass like I always do if you're coming from the 360 going to the PS3 and you have the shooters, you might want to reconsider getting the Raven because the sensitivity is really high and it might cause a lot of frustration. But if you're coming for sports, then for Madden, if you can control Bliss in the line, then you're good to go. And with 2K, it feels right at home. It's like hardly any difference that I notice. If you want to check out the Raven for yourself, you can pick it up from Nyko.com. It's $35. With that being said, Search Journal Pro. I hope you like the review, and I'm out. So cute!